Hello my fellow egg kids, my name is Liz, I'm a certified technician. Today we're going to go over to see how many processes or applications are running on your Windows 11 computer, the ones you can see and the ones in the background. So let's get right to it. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to take my mouse here and I'm going to go down to that blank spot next to this grouping right here. And I'm going to go right next to it and I'm going to right click on it. And as you can see right here, this little bar opens up and I'm going to click on Task Manager. And this will open up. Now keep in mind, also you can just search for it down below and, and type in task manager and it will come right up. So keep that in mind, that's also an option and then you would click on it. Uh, but I already have it open here. So this is great because as you can see, all these apps, all the background processes running and it gives you an idea of what's happening with your computer. Because you ever been trying to upload a video or edit a video or online gaming and you're doing something that you know would take up a lot of resources but for some reason your computer is so bogged down and you're not exactly sure why for example right now I'm recording this video and it's taking up a lot of my memory and you know some of my CPU not so much my disk because it has a it saves in the cloud so that's the, that's part of the reason um, so I have an idea where where are my resources going right so that's a good thing to keep in mind for example if I was running this on my desktop my desktop has like 128 gigs of RAM so this memory number would be like way down but because I'm on my laptop right now it's way higher so it gives you an idea of where your research is going um, keep in mind sometimes uh, you can actually end processes so if something's running you don't intend like for this right here you can hit and task but keep in mind be careful doing with these background processes because that could be something that you actionately need so sometimes you know we get a little click happy with things and then we end up sh uh, shutting off something that maybe we shouldn't have so keep that in mind but anyway if you found this video in any way helpful please like share and subscribe for more great content but anyway from one egghead to another egghead this is Liz signing out